Happy Sunday, folks! So yeah, we've uh, we've got big old fluffy snowflakes uh, falling down outside the uh, the house. Hopefully not inside the house. We have enough of the elements that get inside the house, so the snow can stay out. But yeah, I hope uh, I hope everyone has uh, some happy holidays if you if you you holiday um, and all that fun stuff. Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna be baking and, and cooking the rest of the day, so I figured I'd. Uh, be at you bright-eyed and bushy-tailed this morning and give you a nice hour-long set or so. We, uh, yeah, we got new tunes. Um, we're gonna play both uh, Hackmatack and uh, Plenty of Reasons Not To. Uh, yeah, I'm stoked. I got five new tunes. How cool is that? Speaking of the number five, we have five shows booked for tour. Five already. That's insane. And I've got like two or three more in in the in the the wings i'm just waiting to confirm how cool is that you guys are crazy i appreciate you all so much so uh yeah appreciates you my next lp out on um, february 16th it has been mastered as well i've heard the mastered version of it my my little heart almost couldn't take it it was just pa plump pa plump and uh, i can't wait to share that with you folks it's gonna be uh something else it's it's the next step it's uh taking my work up and uh, up a level. And uh, that's that's thanks to Julia Norelli. She's uh, fantastic. She knows her way around a, a, a sound. Uh, yeah, it's pretty, it's pretty crazy. I'm so stoked. Um, my, my lovely wife, Jess, has started the album art as well. Um, pretty much all the idea is, is, is out there. It's, it's there. Um, next step is uh, coloring and then um, doing the, the liner notes and the lyric books and all that stuff, because we're, we're sending it. We're gonna do a, a really fancy CD this time, and we're really close to getting vinyls too, so your, your folks support are getting us there. So vinyls are next. So uh, yeah, wow, that's pretty cool. What a time to be alive. <laughs> so uh, here we go, here's some tunes. I got two cups of coffee again, it's the same two cups because I find their, uh, the amount of coffee they can hold in proportion to the thickness of the ceramic, so how quick it cools, is pretty good. So if I have two of them, I can normally get through them in an hour long set, but it's pretty good. This is Root Rock. <laughs> Coffee mug with a little bit of grass. 
of metallic sliding lids, not dissimilar from the company in which I hid his favorite corn of beer in the dagger from my head. Yeah, 
and started and started shuffled down my old rock wall. Ginseng and honey. So yeah. Oh, that was good. That was fun. Um, it's always a treat uh, when I have um, songs that I can run into each other like that. Um, I've, I've made made point of this in uh, posts on social media and whatnot, but I, growing up listening to and, and playing in and seeing live a lot of uh, jam bands uh, where that is, uh, that is the bread and butter. If you could play three of your songs into each other seam seamlessly which is neat. Or at least with a pause that you like, you're like, what's coming next? That note's still hanging. Which gives me a time to take a sip of coffee. But, uh, but yeah, yeah. I enjoy playing those and it's always a treat playing them on the, this beauty because um, they got more of a spring in their step. They're a little more bouncy. And uh, I do enjoy that. So. But yeah, so. For those that have tuned in in prior years, I have uh, not to Sunday socials, but just on the, the social medias, I am uh, I'm making that uh, a candy cane bread today. Where it's, um, I think it, it's Betty Crocker recipe from like the 40s or the 50s, something like that. And my mom's always done, and you, you cut up cherries and, and apricots, and you put them down a long piece of um, pastry dough, I guess. Um, scissor cut it all and then you fold it and you braid it all and then it ends up looking like a candy cane. It's pretty wild. I'll post pictures wherever. I'm, well, I guess I can't on YouTube. Uh, Patreon. I'll throw them on Patreon or Instagram later. I have so much fun doing it. I think we're making three this year. So I'm gonna finish this up, get this uploading, and I'm gonna go bake some breads. I know it was my job first thing to cut up all the cherries and the apricots, which it's a very tasking, a, a tedious task. And I don't know if you've ever cut a cherries before but they stain so I'm probably gonna throw in some gloves so I don't have red tips so we got new territory for you folks here we go this is um this is the new tune um, this is plenty of reasons not to um, and um, there is uh, a demo of this on the Patreon, if you are so inclined. Um, for Patreon, if, you, if you're not familiar, um, it's only like two bucks a month is the lowest tier um, where you can get all those songs. You can download them. And if you find you don't want to do Patreon, you can end your subscription. No big deal. Um, it's as easy as that. Um, they do have a free thing you can do, but I, it, it's, a, it's a whole separate thing on my end. So unless I'm posting just to a, the free column, um, 
there's nothing posted there. So if you sign up for the free and you don't see me posting anything, that's, I guess, why. Um, it's something new they're doing. It's strange. But um, if you join for two bucks, you can see a ton of music and get uh, early access to these kind of things. You can get uh, all that jazz. Um, yeah, it's neat. So over there, I put a demo of this. I've got five demos up there right now. Just uh, ideas so I can kind of see uh, place points where um, these songs were when I first wrote them. And then when I do get to studio record them down the line, probably like a year from now, give or take, um, I'll, I'll have what my idea was. Because, I mean, they'll they'll change. I mean, they won't be the exact same. Uh, they really get honed in during these sets or any live sets, which is neat. So, um, yeah. I've just, I've gotten more comfortable using uh, my old, uh, decades old, oh, you can even see it, this little square right here. It's my old MIDI box. I got it on eBay when I was in high school. So it's from like 2007, something like that. It still works. This is a, about the same age. Andy, we hear you. What's up, beautiful girl? Drinking some water. You'll hear the critters, but that's one thing that's standing up on socials is I'm not at pet height. So they're going to be down here seriously sleeping over here. Come on, sleep, good boy. Good boy. All right, we'll get back to this. But like I said, there's a demo on this one. The demo came out pretty cool, if I can say so myself. I think it came out pretty cool. Yeah, here we go. Plenty of reasons not to. Sorrow 
was heard The old folks had no The stigma can grow <laughs> So, that's the first time I played it all the way through on the uh, The Jazz Master here So that was neat Last night I was noodling um, I like to noodle it in the evenings and just uh, play around. So I was just uh, mostly seeing if it was uh, even something I would want to attempt. And I did, I do, I always do. I don't even know why I questioned it in the first place. I used to when I first got this guitar, which um, this guitar was made. It didn't even exist before March of this year, which is insane. They made it for me. I don't name it. If I named it, it would die. But yeah, so this is a nice guitar and I love it. And when I first got it, I was trying to separate all my songs into what songs I would save for this guitar and what would play on the, the Martin. And now it's just, everyone gets played on everyone. It's just, uh, it, it's, it's, it's neat to um, have that texture option, I guess. So some sets and I'm like, yeah, this is a Martin day. Or I'll pull out the old Aria, which is my nylon string guitar um, from the 60s. It was made in Japan. Um, or this. And to be able to play uh, the songs on all three different instruments is uh, refreshing. It's neat. I hope, uh, well, I mean, some of you have told me directly it's refreshing. But I hope for the ones that haven't vocalized it, that it's a, a nice switch up. It's nice for you to hear something different. Hopefully. Use my hopes with the boulder of self. Hopes are strange to me. Huh. All right. So yeah. So I'm not going to say too many close details about um, where I'll be on this tour. But what I can say is um, the album comes out on the 16th. We're doing an album release party and tour kickoff on the 17th. Um, which uh, would probably be somewhere close to my house. Maybe, uh, maybe in the, the, the town or city of Glens Falls. Wink, wink. So maybe jot that down uh, if you're trying to make plans for uh, Saturday, February 17th in Glens Falls. Details to come. Hello, wife. I love you. Sirius placed himself. He's just chilling. Hey, mom, you got any snacks in the kitchen? Big toenails. You won't hear him. He's got... He's a big dog. His toenails are, like, that big around. They're just... He's like walking on pencils. It's intimidating. But, okay, back to where I was going. So kick it, kick it off in New York. Then we'll probably uh, nosey over to Vermont. Keep on moseying over to Maine. Probably have to come back from Vermont at some point. And then there's a lot more of New York to hit. That's about as vague as I'm gonna keep it. Five shows so far across three states. That's pretty cool, man. That's pretty cool. Keep it there. I tell 
rack is true to his word. Found his love in songs of earth. I know the couple sing for Stuck between deciduous and conifer Let winter fake my death Help my needles fall All the way down to yellow Time feathered in the caterpillar ear Spawns bluff, beg the question, what have I been hungering for? This dash long swiss Attack. That one maybe hasn't been done on the Jazz Master either. That's pretty neat to think. It's not too neat to think, as I was just gonna reach in my pocket and grab the first thing and assume it was chapstick. And it was a Sharpie. Found the chapstick. Andy, yeah, it would have been so funny. You could have laughed at me. You've been such a good girl. Got some scratches. Oh, goodness gracious. Oh, goodness gracious. She's crazy. She gets, she's been pretty wild lately. You start petting her and she's like, oh, I love getting pet. And she just slaps at you with the claws of death. Pretty good. Shake it. Goober. Hmm. 
impeccable timing. We're at 30 minutes nearly on the punch. And I'm almost done with my first cup of coffee. Mm, coffee. We're right about halfway through the set, so that's perfect. Could you imagine that? attached to you and she'll hold on for dear life and then when you try to set her down if you're moving her for safety purposes she's like no so you gotta be very uh well planned out it's gotta be very well planned out if you're gonna move anybody yes <laughs> but i hope everyone's sunday is just just lovely um if you have to travel anywhere do it safely i hope i've only got a hike up hike up mountain which isn't too bad. And it's not that big of a mountain. Well, it is a big mountain, but how much? 
much I get the climbs not that much so uh, yeah but yeah safe travels anyone's traveling otherwise if you're staying at home enjoy that too safe travels amongst the house I don't want you to go all crazy if I only said have safe travels if you're leaving the house and then you just go running around your house and you bump into something get yourself hurt and then it's my fault so safe travels around your houses too please where are we i meant contextually on the set list but it was also begs the question where are we right now This one was on decompose. Our lovely petals so soon to peel. They unfurl, they beguile, invoke us all. Soft coaxing, soft snow shakes free. Spring has yet to be sprung. Thought taught and coiled, calm though impending. Thought taught and coiled, Calm though impending, time kept through trillium blooms, time dissolved through fungal fruits, our own sapotrophic dependence to the fall, and her own infatuation with the care. <laughs> Strolling down the walk this morning and he's picking the snow.
oldest song I got. I was snow riddled. That was, um, in Other Lies You're Told as a Child into Corbidet Ballet, which, um, sounds nice. Jess, you want to see something weird? I didn't even know where she is, I just hear her. <coughs> there you are, Andy. Yeah. Be a sneaky snack. It's called Andy's a Sneaky Snack. I think so. This one is a uh, serious smells of deer. Which, um, I mean, it works out. If Andy is a slippery snake, serious ought to be smelling the deer. One would suppose. One may come to those conclusions. Serious, go lay down. Serious place. That would have been absolutely catastrophic. Andy was under the amp, and Sirius was about to pounce on her. Otherwise, I would never, Please. ever, ever stop. Lay down. Lay down. Waterboarding. You know why? Made in the bottle. It's the usher in the aisle. It's basket tax. Your denial, baptized, Monday gin and rye. With her into myself, nor is we, the lowercase high that is you that's me, interjecting ourselves until selfless, 
Empathise with the faithless Identifying with the number five Blood vessels burst beneath your eyes Black zip ties and garbage bags Vignette your bottom latch Vignette your bottom latch Thank you for uh, just, she's been crazy doing loops and she was under that cord and I saw Sirius get up and oh, yeah, causing trouble. Let's see if I can reach and see her like. We have a dimmer bulb and an LED bulb in there and that doesn't fly if you don't know that. So if it, sometimes it quivers up and then I don't know if the room's shaking or if it's just the lights. But that was Sirius Smells a Deer, but in that case, Andy turned into a snake and Sirius smelled the snake and the snake was Andy and it wasn't Chandy and Chandy's doing fine. Chandy's under his paper right now because he thinks it's winter and he's right. It is winter. Snakes don't hibernate, they burmate and snakes are burmating right now. So Chandy's trying to burmate and he's like, is it warmer in here? And he stuck his head out yesterday and we saw him. He was peeking around looking like a good boy, but now he's back in there. So we use a craft paper, a butcher's paper to line his tank. It's easier. That way he doesn't eat any sawdust if he goes for a mouse. That's what Chandy and Andy and Sirius are up to right now. Andy's eating, actually. She's hungry. She had all that razzmatazz, all that adventure this morning. Yeah. I've got, um, I've got uh, four more tunes for you. We're looking at we're 13 minutes away from an hour. I think that should work out. One's a poem, so it's a little bit shorter. My mom is already done with the yeasting thermometer. Oh, good. She's told me telepathic. Try to keep us there in a bank full of bookstores. Most folks underwhelm me, grandiose stories have banks. Leopard on lurking in the bottom end of my lake. Big chair, cigarette on the old Shanklin ferry. Sand says no smoking, organic, full body taste. Blue moon palms airing out, southbound on the north way. Snuck past the state trooper, my $3 thrift shop shirts. Moncton Borough. Where 
are we next? I tried to hit this set list being uh, one of um, either cold or the opposite, which I don't know if hot is always the opposite of cold. I'm sure there is. I meditate on the morning and in the summer sun I face it. In winter and her distance I face my own hearth, tending to a personal star, consuming what I feed it. If only the sun would eat. On second thought, gaseous autophagy fits her. On third thought, no, why can't I cast myself right on through and into the sun? A flash in the pan, a stardust cake broom, like the tail of the king beetle on the coconut estate. Why not be utterly changed into fire? <laughs> birth to the seasons, having met us in snow, a billion years burning, several rocks in the throne, a guy as her sister. Though they seldom speak, unless you swore words, as the air passes, silence and substance punctuate time. As solar flares dance, pink holds a rush. softly inspired a sweet static storm he wraps color forward a magnet flower blooms pollen with pores Polarity drifting sends them off course. New fields will blossom. The wake of the strokes. Sisters in tandem, the way of a
tackles tan and tail and he told Takes your time as his eye mother's soul Burn upon dry so the frog legs grow in sadness Is the water wet, soil sound defeated Spent too long in the shade, many happiness to snowy days. Then in the cloud, take credit to mine. So I built me a weather machine, for it's self help in my estate. Germinate for yourself. Shoot out fruits, I swear it helps to fill a field in love and care. It starts to sell. Spread it now, so we can solve. My smile splits the shell, ladybugs fill my cell. Bleached white in the sun, sea stars and daughters, hygroscopic lovers. Day. It's the death of a water this way, you need to go life in your own hands, so self-serving. Germinate for yourself, shoot out roots, I swear it helps, to fill a field with love and care, it starts to sell. My beach dream with a similar song, Narcissus, puddle jumping on a quiver. Not too fond of sinking, nor can I swim that well. But the weather machine is a submersible, landlocked lake in a swimming pool, glass of gin in a triple drool. folks there's a there's a, another sunday social for the books we're at 59 59 minutes and 30 seconds well hot damn how's that for timing within a half a minute not bad not bad but uh yeah i hope i hope your sundays are lovely um yeah um hopefully by this time next week when i chat with you again i'm going to tell you an absurd amount of shows we've got booked for the tour which is uh, the plan Setting plans lately has been working out pretty well. Making to-do lists and getting them done, you know. Rock and roll. Andy's back. She's gonna. Oh, she's about to wreak some havoc. I'm gonna. I'm gonna turn off things before she starts just ripping the house down. So everyone have a lovely day. Um, I'll see some of you folks on Wednesday at the midweek meetup on Patreon. The rest of you, I'll see you on Sunday for our next uh, Sunday social. It'll. Yeah, it'll still be. Oh man, is a uh, yeah next Sunday, New Year's Eve. Shit, it will be the uh, it'll be the last Sunday social of the year. I didn't know if this was gonna be, so I was gonna preface it now. But no, I'll see you next Sunday. It'll be the last one of the year. We've done one every I think every Sunday this year. No, I was on tour for some of those. Almost every Sunday of the year. 
pretty cool. So with that said, if you want to go find a bunch of music, there's a lot of them. I guess there's a lot of Sundays in the year, so. There's a lot of Wednesdays too. So if you want even more than that, go to Patreon. Otherwise it's on YouTube. There's a, I'll, it, it, it actually should be popping up right now. You'll get a square over here, a square over here, and a circle. So click subscribe if you haven't subscribed. Um, click one of these squares, or maybe it's over here. Subscribe's gonna be over here, maybe. I don't know. Square, one of them's gonna be uh, live sets. You click that one. The next one's gonna be, uh, it's gonna be something. I know I got two squares over here and I gotta, I gotta subscribe. So I'm figuring this stuff out one, one day at a time. Uh, but take care. Bye bye. Auf Wiedersehen. Toodles. Uh,